In order to reduce contrast, computer screens and electronic devices like smartphones emit a lot of unfocused visual noise called blue light. Blue light is the main factor that contributes to digital eye strain and likewise skin damage. A new study even suggests that blue light can cause macular degeneration, which is one of the leading causes of blindness. For this reason, prolonged screen time is highly discouraged especially among children. So in this video, we will show you how to enable the blue light filter on your Galaxy S21. To begin, pull up the app drawer and tap on settings. While in the settings menu, find and tap display. Doing so will load up another menu where you can manage your phone's display features settings. To continue, toggle the eye comfort shield switch. This will enable the eye safety feature using the default options. If you wish to configure more options based on how you'd like the eye comfort shield feature to work on your device, tap eye comfort shield to access the screen for you to make necessary alterations. To change the default color, tap custom. Doing so will let you select your preferred color temperature according to your liking and set a schedule when you'd like that change to take effect on your phone. Among the available options include the always on, which is the default, sunset to sunrise and custom. If you choose custom, you will be routed to another menu where you can adjust the schedule accordingly. There is also an option for you to adjust the color temperature intensity. To do so, just drag the slider from left to right until you find the color temperature that suits your preference. Once you've set up your preferences, you can easily enable this feature through the Quick Settings panel. Just pull down the Quick Settings menu, and then swipe left to find the Eye Comfort Shield icon. Once found, simply tap on it to turn on the feature. You will know when it's turned on when the icon turns blue from gray. And that's pretty much it. We hope this tutorial can help you. Please support us by subscribing to our YouTube channel. We need your support so that we can continue publishing helpful contents in the future. Thanks for watching.